Today we're going to be reviewing the Nova Tractor BX2000E wood chipper. Now there's one thing I've learned from Nova Tractor from purchasing their equipment is that ratings and capacities are merely suggestions. You have to check out my review on their flail mower. I'm going to put a link to that at the end of this video. That gives you an idea how durable their equipment is. So I'm excited to test this out today. So let's take a closer look here. So now the reason I went with this particular model is because it's towable. I didn't want to get one for a tractor because a lot of people, one, don't have a tractor, and two, you have to drag your tractor everywhere you want to use your chipper shredder. This can be towed behind an ATV, small SUV, uh, have you. So it's a lot more adaptable for taking through the woods or anywhere else you need to take it where you want to be uh, chipping brush. You do have an electric start right here. I don't have my battery on right now, but, and we do also have a pull start. Something else I did right as soon as I bought it was I added this hour meter, and you can get these in different colors. I'm going to put a link to that video at the end of this one as well. Um, you can add these hour meters onto any gas-powered equipment, so it's great for keeping track of the use uh, for maintenance reasons. We have our adjustable chute that will go all the way around and also up and down to direct our chips wherever we want them. Our emergency stop button there if things get squirrely. And this does tow very well behind the ATV. I've already put about two hours on this machine. And I like the way the jack folds up. You don't have to sit there and crank it for forever. Once you get it so high and hook it on your ATV, it'll just uh, fold up and set that way. Now the capacity on this is up to four inches, but again, Nova Tractor really underrates their equipment. So I'm excited to show you what this can do. Um, four inches is pretty stinking big. Now, I personally would never chip four inches. We burn wood, so we would be using that in the burner. But right here, this is about three and a half inches, and down here where some of the knots are, we get to four inches. But like I said, that's a pretty stinking big chunk of wood. So I think four inches will be more than enough for any standard homeowner. So enough talking, let's get this fired up and let's see what it can do. So now once we get this fired up, it's gonna be a little bit loud. So I'm gonna tell you now, we're gonna start off with two inches. Then these are closer to three. This one gets up to four, and this one is four inches down through there. So we're gonna step it up. We didn't come here to see me shred twigs. We came here to see what this machine can do. So let's get to it. like nothing and you see how fast I pulled that down through. chip size here. It's just perfect small mulch size chips. But I mean come on that was four inches and it just rips it right down through there like nothing. And if you're doing actual brush with branches you don't get that little piece of log bouncing around like we do at the end there. But yeah, I am highly impressed with this. This will more than do anything the average homeowner is going to need. Like I said, we fed four inch sticks through there. Grab a measuring tape, go out in your backyard and see what you're going to be chipping, shredding. And if it's less than four inches, this will easily handle it. Um, I have no doubt this would handle even bigger. Now, unfortunately, you can't do any bigger because it simply won't fit through the opening down there. But up to four inches, absolutely no problem. So absolutely get online, check it out, nova-tractor.com. Be sure to mention Redneck Tech in the promotion uh, coupon code box at checkout uh, for some free spare parts. I believe they're gonna send you some knives, things like that. Um, there are four knives to this flywheel, but just does an excellent, excellent job. You will not be disappointed. Go online, spec it out to other makes and models. You're not gonna find a better deal. So I hope you found that as impressive as I did. Again, at the end of this video, check out the links on how to install an hour meter on your gas powered equipment. And also check out the review I did on Nova Tractor's flail mower. Very impressive stuff. 
and be sure to let them know you saw it on Redneck Tech for some free spare parts. As always, I really appreciate you watching and thank you for your support.